Alright, sorry about that, friends. I had to take the doggos outside. They were letting go some, uh, some stinky toots and needed to go potty. Huh. Alright. Power stage is charging for reignition. And now let's see what happened to you. It's almost as if someone did a manual shutoff. Fetching operation record. I don't understand. This can't be right. There must be a glitch in the system. Who's there? Am I beating something? What the heck? Okay, so did Eva actually get in a car wreck there? And why do I have a broom? And why am I swinging it? Like it's... Well, I'm pushing alt and it doesn't do anything. Footsteps. Oh, someone came in. Who? But the door was locked. Alt. Push the button. Yeah. <laughs> I just shoved a mop into her face. There you are. Power restored. How's the towel, hon? Eh? Uh, yes, song. That helps, thanks. What's wrong with you? You know what are gonna whack my sister like that? Eh? <laughs> Jeez, it was an accident, alright? Your face was an accident. Ha ha ha! That's my kind of humor. You just go around the office swinging a broom all around all day? Look, I was in beast mode and she just suddenly appeared on my turf. It's not my fault I was born with such crazily fast reflexes. Why did you guys come over anyway? You're one to ask. Staying all alone in the office on your holiday off? Who does that? It was her idea. Darn right it is. I ain't having no partner of my sister sulk by himself a night like this. <laughs> I wasn't sulk. You just shut up and listen. Eva calls in some old friends and we're all gonna have a nice dinner together. I love Tracy. And you're gonna enjoy every moment of it. Wow, you kind of remind me of someone I know. There, there, hon. It's actually not that bad. What was that? Why is he still here? <laughs> shoo, shoo. This is great. <laughs> is this a little kid playing with presents? Can I open the box, Dad? Can I? This is great. Oh, there's a guy here. I didn't see him. Go ask Aunt Eva. It's not ours. Wait a minute. This is the office. Okay, I didn't leave the office yet. Alright, uh... Later, Fritz. Really? Uh-oh. Why are you back? Something strange is going on here. Oh, hiya. I thought you went home. Yeah, I thought so too. But as I was happily peeking out on the couch, Eva called me and asked for a pickup. What? But she's already here. Something is strange. Hello! What the? Oh, those are the kids! 
No. Those are the kids from the first one. Uh-oh. Hi, Uncle Neil. That's the last time... The last time you two came by, you called me Poo Poo Face. That was Tommy. He's mean. <laughs> oh no, he does. Blah, 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 blah. That's what that was. Well, wow, that kid's growing up to be a lizard. <laughs> yeah, sorry, Lily. Lily, oh no. It's been a while, Neil. Yep, Eva just dragged you guys right out of your loving home, huh? Oh, it's nice to come and visit. The kids were getting bored at home anyway. I don't know there's all these voices anymore. Wow, wow, wow. Let's go talk inside. We could be missing dinner by now. She, she, that girl's after my own heart. I want some dinner. Oh, yes, I should go say hi. Hmm. I wasn't controlling him there. What is that, a beaver? It's plat plat? Oh, he's got a platypus. Oh no. That's plat plat. Not mine, but my son is his caretaker now. I protect it from all evil. Can I see it? Are you evil? Not really. Hmm, okay. I'm gonna play a plant for five minutes. Hey, Plat Plat likes you. How can you tell? Because it's not trying to get away, duh. <laughs> this kid just spinning around. Hey, are you a real doctor? What do you mean? Oh, I'm Rosalie now. Or Rosaline. Like, do you do surgeries and stuff? No. Then you're not a real doctor. Uh, do you listen to Dr. Dre? No? Me neither. But Neil says Dre's not a real doctor, and he's still mad. <laughs> <laughs> But Neil says Dre is not a real doctor and he's still getting mad respect, so back off. That's funny. These people are clever in the world of this game. Hey Jamie, what are you doing with this stuffed animal? Don't wuss out on me, son. Let your kid play with a freaking platypus. She likes that, it's just plat pat. Feeling all better? I'll live. You know, Eva, man, you gotta come over more. I rarely see you anymore. Well, winter tends to be our busy season. Hopefully I'll get over more of a break soon. Don't work too hard now. You know I'm always here if you need me. Thanks for helping to drive Lily and the kids over. No biggie, as long as you hold up your side of the deal. Ha! <laughs> yeah, I got it. I'm serious. Two buckets of ice cream, no cheap outs. <laughs> yeah, Roxy, I will. Like, we're talking jumbo size here, with a capital J. She loves ice cream, I like this girl. And when I say bucket, I mean buckets. As in, I want to use them as a recycling bins when I'm done with them. <laughs> yeah, where do you shop? <laughs> <laughs> I like the game. The writing gets me good. Hey, has anyone seen Neil? We ran into him in the hall. Oh, we ran into him in the hall, but he didn't follow us back in. He just like he went back down for some reason. All right, down we go. OK, 
Okay, it just took me where I needed to go, I guess. Alright. Are we going back to the... The basement? I guess so. Hmm. Access profile loaded, Dr. Eva Rosaline. Power settings. Operational record. I want to know who did it. Fetching operational record. Emergency manual shut down. Whoa. Neil did the emergency shutdown. And eight minutes later, he restarted it. Weird. Why did he shut down and then restart it himself? All right. Power settings. No point in messing around with that. Okay. Neil, are you losing your mind? All right. This isn't gonna let me in still, right? Need to find Neil. Okay, maybe there was more left I could go to. No. This isn't an exit. Okay, maybe there's something downstairs I missed. There's nothing down here. Hmm. Yeah, I want to find Neil, just... There's nowhere to go. mouse change? Aha! This is where he punches me in the face of the broom, right? I didn't do this earlier, but the icon didn't show up. Nope. There's tomatoes on the ground. Hello? Who's calling? I keep calling this person. Who is this? Son? Is that you, Neil? Oh, snap. Why aren't you talking to them? Was this something they did? No, it's not them. Then why? Why did you come back? I told you already, it was my sister's idea. You could have stopped her. What? Look, thanks for coming back and bringing the folks and all. But just... Don't do something like that again. Do what? Where are you going? Home. Oh, I've got things to work on. What the hell's wrong with you? I don't know what's going on in here. But for pineapple's sake, loosen up. I love her curse words. I forgot about that. Those people came all the way out here to spend the evening with you. When was the last time you even had dinner with other people? My sister brought her family to keep you company. Even Lily and the kids came. You still remember them, right? You even made that stupid game based on that case. What are you going to do when you go home? Go eat a frozen pizza by yourself? Just give yourself a break for tonight, sheesh. Anyway, I'm not going to just stand out here in the cold tossing words at you. You do what you want. I'm heading, I'm heading inside. 
Just know that there's a chairs upstairs for you, whether you're coming or not. That's the end? I'm so confused. What was the point of the mini-sodes? Okay, so they're all eating dinner. <laughs> Neil's running around. Did he steal the platypus? Duck Duck Pony. I like that name. Okay, so if I'm gonna guess at what the heck just happened. Neil was calling his his family. Oh. Guess nothing. Neil was calling his family. Maybe to hang out with him or something. And, uh... But he never talked to him on the phone. He just kind of listened to him. A message. Jordan, a friend who's created many free birds pixel art from the Moon's Lighthouse and blah blah blah, is currently hospital- Oh no! He's in chemotherapy. When you enjoyed his work, please consider sending a donation to his family. His mom's PayPal address is that. You can also- Alright, Laura B23. Alright, I'm gonna add that to the, um title. I don't know if... This game's old, though, so it may not be active anymore, but... I'm gonna do it anyway. There you go. You can send supportive words to Jordan at freebirdgames.com Bam. Press enter to continue. Crap, now I'm gonna have to look up that. See if the guy's okay. Oh, there's more. Okay. Well? Well, what? That wasn't so bad, was it? Everybody had a good time. Yeah, I guess so. Hey, can you guys give me a lift? Whoa, whoa! Uh-oh. Hey, can you guys give me a lift? Neil said he needs the company car tonight. Here, hon. Let's get you home. Okay, so... I think my theory was correct. That... She got in a car wreck, and she's actually in bed right now, or she's dying. And so they're rewriting her, her story. What? Okay, is, um... Okay, so then I need to I need to look up Bird Story. Because the first mini so referenced Bird Story. Um If Bird Story is to the moon. Oh. I wanted to know if Bird Story was a sequel, but Bird Story is an adventure role-playing video game developed and published by Freebird Birds or Freebird Games. It was released in November 2014 as a minisode connecting the previous games, previous game by Freebird to the moon. Wait a minute. 
Oh. No? I'm confused. Okay, so those minisodes, was that Bird Story? Is that what's that? I thought a Bird Story was another game. I'm kind of confused. I thought it was its own game. One hour interactive animation about a boy and an injured bird. Yeah, okay, so that's different. Okay. A bird story. Released as a minisode connecting the previous game to the moon with its sequel, Finding Paradise. Okay. Okay, I understand. So, you have To the Moon, Finding Paradise is the sequel, and Bird Story is the minisode connecting them. Okay, so I need to play Finding Paradise. Okay. So, maybe Finding Paradise... Sorry, I'm looking these up. Is two doctors rising through? Okay, no, it says through a dying man's memories and artificially fulfill his last wish, but that's what the to the moon is based on. And like a lot of these cutscenes and videos on Steam are from to the moon. No, no, no. Um. No. Okay. I'm so confused. Okay. I don't know, guys. I'm confused. I don't know. Because from what I understood right there, Eva was the one that is, you know, is messing up her memory. So why would it be? Why would Finding Paradise be about a guy? Or maybe the minisodes are just to mess with your mind. To be like, yo, Eva got hit by a car and they're going to have to rewrite her story. I never finished playing that game in the game either. Jada, hey. At least Jada, at least you stop when I say hey. Good doggo. Um, I'm very, very, very confused at what the implications of all this are. So, I guess I'm going to have to check out Bird Story and Finding Paradise at some point, but it's 9 o'clock. Those, uh, those went through rather quickly. Um, those other games are my wish list, so I won't forget about them, which is good. I just have to pick them up at some point uh, when I decide to play them. But, I'm going to end this series off Ooh, excuse me, right here, right now. Uh, maybe we'll play something else afterwards, or uh, I need to eat, because I woke up late and I haven't eaten. Doggos need to eat as well. Um, maybe I'll just go to bed. Maybe I'll try to get my sleep schedule back on track, even though I've only been awake for five hours or something like that. So, Anyways, this is an actual exit of uh, the... or an actual gameplay, so I will do a full outro for once. Uh, since nothing's been up on YouTube for a while, hopefully... Uh, I'll still be in YouTube's algorithm as a general uploader kind of thing, but I guess we'll find out. Thank you guys so much for tuning in with me. Hope you guys liked it. If you did, remember to like, subscribe, comment. It helps me out a lot. Let's me know what you're liking, what you're not liking. But more importantly, remember to spay new to your pets, adopt, don't shop, donate to a rescue if you can afford it, or open up your house up to the possibility of fostering. That is a very rewarding experience and helps those animals and rescues out that are very much in need. Anyway, I'm Invasive. This little needy one here is Jada's. Mom's over there uh, looking for another toy to chew on. Thank you so much for tuning in with me, and I'll catch you next time. See ya. Boop, 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 boop.